Hi everyone. Uh, yesterday I got a mail from UBS. Um, previously I applied um, UBS uh, for interview purpose. Uh, before technical interview, they want to uh, conduct an assessment uh, related to UBS company, um, some uh, culture math assessment. So they send a link, uh, a link for that to attend that interview that assessment. So I attended that assessment and I recorded for uh, for your reference purpose. Uh, if you people, uh, anyone apply, apply for a UBS, that assessment would be. Uh, like this, it will be helpful. Uh, just go through it uh, and find some useful information from this assessment. Thank you.
overhead your conversion and parallels you know how to proceed he explains that the protocol to have two operations is important to protect ebs and clients from loss and fraud the call back on when it explains he tells you not to worry she will take responsibility for any loss and asks you again to complete the trade he explains it apologize that you cannot complete the request and tell your manager about the request to create protocol apologize and ask for all while you discuss with your colleagues if the account manager can take action apologize and can't not complete the request until you have the second authorization your colleague asks for explanation you turn to your next task you need to input information on on your new client from the contract that signed into ubs system as you look through the contract you notice that the person conflict of interest section doesn't uh, look like it has been completed however contracts are not your area of expertise ask some of your own more experienced colleagues if they think that income section is likely to be an issue so others the uh, trust that your colleagues will have completed the necessary section get back to inputting information contact the contracts department to explain that the personal contract of interest doesn't have yet been completed You have, you have been supporting senior manager and have developed a good relationship with him. When you meet with him today, he asks you to support him with a new request. The request is something that the department looks after, but that you do not usually support with. So you only have a basic knowledge of this area. Research more about this area after meeting so that you can continue supporting. And ask a colleague who usually works on this area for advice so you can continue the supporting. Him. Explain that this is not your area, not your area of expertise, and introduce a senior manager to your colleague who can support him. Your colleague is really helpful, and you are able to support the senior manager. You find yours, yourself uh, leaning on your colleague's expertise uh, quite often in the company. She is enthusiastic about guiding you. So since you feel like you are using up a lot of her time, but you know you still need her when time for a week, more weeks. Continue as far as for now, no knowing you will not take up her time after a few weeks. Discuss with her a mutually agreed plan about how and when you should consult with her. Try to do more independent research so that you can gradually rely on her less often. Continue with the current uh, arrangement later that week you are working at your branch to support the rollout of your project. While you are there, a wealth management advisor comes forward and asks for your help in starting a banking app for a client who is, who is his next appointment. Uh, who has added the advisor explains that he is not familiar with the app and cannot help the client directly. The request should only take two address, but you have a lot to get through today. Look up the event and support on our hotline number and give this to the wealth management advisor. Apologies and explain to the wealth management advisor that you cannot help with this. Join the wealth management advisor department to help install the app for the client. Running due diligence checks for your business. Ask one of your colleagues for a second opinion on whether these invoices are legitimate. Research your client's specific service to understand if they match the client's needs. Type of the invoices. Uh, legit checks on a business client, a small but high. Finding a developer to help continue to improve robot. Ask the team members if they think that the robot is working. Support to team. Go back to your old ma manual process and tell the manager that the robot is working. Now all the correct documents start checking them. Your team has recently started using the robot that automates some of your checks. Realize that the robot hasn't picked up some information and then you do not fully understand how the robot works. However, you know that robot has been fully tested uh, and that this was its using often enough. You should continue to learn and improve. Discuss your finding with developers to help continue to improve the robot. Ask your team members if they think that robot is working as it is supposed to be. Go and learn about it and tell them that robot is not working. Uh, you are in a team meeting and your line manager tells you they are going to introduce a change to the workload management system. You are saying that they are difficult to find. Wait until after the meeting and speak to your manager privately. They speak across the team while you are agree with your manager that some things could be improved. The proposal to include changing some things uh, currently work well, and you think that new approach sounds like it may it will make this more difficult. Pick up how to alert your manager and team to the potential issues. Don't say anything as your manager has already said. Set out. You alert your manager and team to the potential of concerns as you discuss them in a very business manner. Uh, six stakeholders outside of them. Speak to six, uh, six stakeholders to talk so how the issues may impact each other. Ask the first stakeholder to act as a representative and tell you how issues impact them. Create a clear, fe clear feedback form and send it to each stakeholder to complete. You arrange to see the various stakeholders over the next two days. You turn your attention to uh, another task which involves inputting large amount of data into the computer system. So after starting this task, you realize that you are entering the same data into two different tools that are frequently but not always together. Continue to enter the data twice as the tools are not always together and uh, find out would be the best 